My introduction to the visual arts was through my mother, who studied art at RMIT in the 1930s and was influenced by the artists of the time, many of whom were her teachers. In the first three years of my architectural course, at, also at RMIT in the 1960s, I was given the opportunity of studying fine art subjects, including art appreciation, where I had to remember the, the period, the title and the artists of a, a couple of hundred works. I was also given the opportunity to learn about the setup for perspective and also the projection of shade and shadow known as skyography. It was not until my retirement in 2010 that I had the opportunity to pursue my interest in painting. In 2013, I joined the Elgin Artists Group in the Melbourne suburb of Hawthorne. And uh, currently we have 17 members, uh, four of whom are female, and we meet weekly and to paint and to solve the problems of the world. In 2017, uh, about a dozen of us went uh, to India, to Rajasthan in northern India, where we uh, drew and painted. And following that, I have held a solo exhibition uh, entitled Black Rock to Bharatpur. In 2018, uh, later in 2018, we also went to Japan and uh, the products of, of that trip uh, were shown in the Art of Powerhouse last year. For ease of transport, I carry all of my painting equipment in this satchel, which I purchased in India in 2017. So as you can see, I have a palette, I have a uh, collapsible cup for water, and I use these very handy discs, which have each of the colours I require for the paintings that I undertake and water for spraying, um, also pens and paint brushes and that's all I need for the work I'm doing at the moment. In recent times I've done all my paintings in an A3 pad, uh, water, watercolour quality paper and that matches the size of affordable IKEA frames which come with a built-in mount. So here's an example of recent work that I've done uh, with my IKEA frame. I just frame it myself and uh, just stick in the page from the pad. My wife Deb has been very accommodating in allowing me to use our guest bedroom, particularly as a, a gallery space for my paintings. Uh, also, we have a number of other ones of my paint, other paintings in other rooms in the house. In early 2019, I had the opportunity to visit both Camperdown and Deniliquin and produced 16 watercolour uh, drawings of the historic buildings and monuments of each town, three of which are shown here. Later in 2019, I accompanied the Elgin artists uh, for a few days up in the Bogon High Plains and my most recent works are based on that trip. Plus a couple I did uh, showing the uh, devastating fires in Gippsland uh, of earlier this year. And finally, uh, two of nine portraits that I did uh, following portraiture classes in 2016. The portraits are of Douglas MacArthur, uh, our American uh, colleague in the Second World War, and the other is Mel Gibson as Braveheart. I'm not quite ready for the Archibald Prize, but I'm getting there. 